Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. It's the bump, welcome you too. She is popping. She, <laughs> she is getting pretty big, 35 weeks, can you believe it? As you can see by the title of the video, we are decorating for Christmas. I am so excited. I am just kind of ready to be done with fall. I'm ready to kind of like move on. And I don't know if that's because by decorating for Christmas, I feel like I'm getting closer to baby girl arriving, but I'm just like so excited to pull all the Christmas decor. So that is what we are doing today. This is also the first time that we're gonna be decorating in this house, which is so exciting. I'm definitely gonna be decorating the staircase this year, which I've never been able to do before. We had stairs in our last house, but it wasn't an open staircase. So I'm gonna put up some garland this year and just like make it super cute and fun. Not too much though, because then that just means I have a lot of stuff that I will have to put away with a newborn. So I'm just trying to keep it simple, but still very festive and cute. I don't think we're gonna decorate or cut up our tree in this video. I'll do it in another video because I don't have Dagan with me. Hello there. Editing Michaela's just popping on to say I definitely lied. You will for sure see the tree at the end of this video. I just didn't film putting it up, but you will definitely see it at the end. So stay tuned for that. If you guys wanna see how I decorate our new home here in Hawaii, even though it's so warm outside, but let's get to decorating. Okay, so I have this box of decor, lots of garland. I actually bought another thing of garland. This is from the Magnolia brand from Target. I think it's hearth and hand or something like that. I can never get it right, but I bought another one because I want to put two up on the staircase. And then I also want to put one on our like TV stand slash bookshelf looking thing. So I bought another one. Okay, so this is like our front reading room that we don't use a whole lot of, but it's just like nice and open at the staircase right here that we're going to decorate. I think I'm gonna take this bookshelf and actually, hopefully I'm not making you dizzy, but put it right here. And then hopefully I'm not making you dizzy again. <laughs> we're gonna take this chair and I think put it over here where it is because I wanna put our Christmas tree up in the corner right here because I think in between these two spots, there just won't be enough room. And that way we can have a nice open spot for the Christmas tree and then still be able to like have our bookshelf over here, which I might put the nativity scene on. We'll see, I'm gonna play around with some stuff. Okay, so before I get started, I do need to move <laughs> this stuff, my hose and you're probably like, why do you have a hose in here? Because it's for my birthing pool. <laughs> and this oof, is the tub. In case you didn't notice, this video is gonna be super chill. I feel like whenever I do like clean with me's or decorate with me's in the past, I've always tried to make sure that my house is like spotless and spick and span and that it looks perfect. And honestly, that is just not reality. So if you see like dishes on the counter or stuff in the corner, I mean, that's just life. I'm in my third trimester and I only have so much energy in the day. to the first arrangement. I moved the couch over the wall, but the chair that was right there over here, and then just put like the plant over in this corner instead. Not my favorite, but there's only so much I can do with this room. And then the tree will go right where you guys are. And it'll be great. It'll be right in the corner. It'll be by the window. We'll still kind of be able to see it. I wish we could put it in our main room where we actually like hang out in the living room and kitchen like dining room is, but there's just, there's nowhere to put it in there. So as far as decor goes, I think I'm gonna start with the garland and hanging it up on the staircase. And we're just gonna do it right here and then right up top here. I'm not doing the second flight because I don't have enough garland. I think I'm gonna use this. I need to cut these little beads off too so they match. I also have, I thought would be cute, is these wooden beads that I made, I think last year, that I can string along with the garland. And then I think what we'll do is hang our stockings along the staircase as well since we obviously don't have a fireplace. And we can just hang like the three of them right there and it'll look 
really cute. A lot longer than I was anticipating. I now know that I need to get like specific garland hanging hooks or something next year. Cause wow, that was so much harder. I think I got my workout walking up and down those stairs. And hopefully this doesn't fall down while we're sleeping tonight. Um, <laughs> I think it looks okay. I am tired from walking up those stairs, but I think it looks good. I think I'm just gonna keep it like this. I was thinking of maybe doing like some burlap bows on the corners maybe, but I think I'm just gonna leave it like this for right now. Oh my gosh, I'm so exhausted. <laughs> and I've only done one thing. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out though where I wanna put my nativity set. I'm thinking a little bookshelf right here, but then I don't know where to put all my books. Let me brainstorm a little bit.
So yes, you can see the tree <laughs> did end up going up in this video. I was originally planning on doing a whole separate video decorating our tree, but I honestly just wanted to put it up and I didn't feel like filming that day. So I just put it up, shot some B-roll. So yes, our tree. Our tree is up. It's very simple. I kept it kind of like similar to last year minus the orange slices because I um, can't really do that here in Hawaii unless I want to attract bugs. And I figured this is going to be the last year that I can kind of do just like a simple aesthetic Christmas tree before I start wanting to put up all the fun decor and just like homemade ornaments that we're going to have for baby and like baby's first Christmas ornament. Like I don't even know if she's obviously coming before or after Christmas. So it's like, I want to buy a baby's first ornament for Christmas this year, but she might not even be here by then. So it's kind of just like, we'll see. But yeah, this is gonna probably be the last year that I have like my style and whatnot before I start, you know, bringing in stuff from her and just kind of making it our own. Because that's one thing that I remember growing up is our tree wasn't perfect. It had just like a mod podge of random ornaments that we made as kids that were up on the tree. Like it was just kind of like its own randomness of things, but I loved it. And I thought that it was so cool growing up. I just really want to incorporate that for our family. But yeah, anyways, Christmas decor is up. Garland, the garland is up. Thanksgiving is in a couple days. I just, I cannot believe it. It is just, it is going so fast. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this decorate with me and I will see you guys in the next video. <laughs> Bye.